What's going on here? I'm gonna figure it out. If someone needs medical attention, I will get them help. But no one move. You literally can just get let go. Oh, we we are all gonna die right now. Oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome back to DOJ, jumping in here doing some Blaine County Sheriff's Office in a Dodge Charger. Now we kind of went through pretty much all the vehicles like a Tahoe, Caprice, and uh, Crown Victoria and all that. And we're going to continue to keep using them. I just really wanted to get in here with a, a some type of like fast car uh, that we could use to kind of get through the streets. Let me make sure I have the Pursuit Mods on, which they are on, so that's perfect. So yeah, a little Dodge Charger slick top with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. We are actually using the EUP still. They've fixed up the pants and they've done it extremely quick. So good job, devs. It looks so much better. Uh, I realized there was golden chevrons to use for the years of service. And then my rank is now on the collar. So we're we're chilling now. Everything's good. Uh, I guess I didn't have that on last time. And I didn't know they were on different levels, which is kind of cool to see. Holy shit, homie in the saddler is smashing. Uh, so we got ourselves a campaign hat. I always thought that lately this has been like a really nice look and just kind of like very proper uh, with the campaign hat and the tie and all that stuff. Uh, I also am still trying to get better from being sick. I would say I am like 95%. Oh my God, I'm knocking stuff over on the desk. I'm like 95% good. You guys see all this shit going on down here? We're going to help out. I don't know what's going on. Dude is smashing. We have no gas. Hold on. Let me... Uh, dude, he's going to take off, too. I don't know if it's going to work. Let's try it here. Um, we are, like, 95% back to normal. It's just a cold or, like, a very mild flu. Holy shit. Um, oh, that was, like, a major accident. He's sideways in the streets right now. We're going to have to stop. I don't know what's going on. We're going to have to see. Well, we're in this, bitch. I love it. Oh, did he get into an accident with the cop? Okay, so that last call that I was about to go out to was actually nothing. Uh, we have a new call that we're routed to right now. It's actually... Uh, dirt bikers doing drifts. I didn't I didn't know you could do a dirt bike drift Maybe I might just not be good on dirt bikes. I have no idea. So we're gonna see Exactly what's going on. I do see the two gentlemen right here. Okay. 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 Whoa. 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 Gentlemen 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 How we doing today? Oh, how's it going? I'm just going any reason why we're doing this in the parking lot? I'm getting 911 calls. Uh, oh, uh, we just didn't want to do it on the road because we didn't get we didn't want to get hit or anything. Right Black driving. Is there a reason why we're not doing it on the dirt? Um, because there's not a lot of dirt here. What do you mean you're in Polito on the outskirts right there? You got a huge dirt road. What is it? Oh, uh, right. this, I'm new this, here. But this concrete, it feels really nice. Medical like that dirt over, it's sand over there. It's not even dirt. Well, there's actually a uh, boat port at the end. Isn't that a little bit paved off? I don't know. Well, I would, uh, how about this? I, I'd say we keep this simple. You guys go look for a better spot than someone's, you know, parking lot. And we're good. Yeah, we were just celebrating because he lost Dodge just when we went Celebrating for what? The LS Dodgers, they just won. Oh, nice. Nice. Yes, I heard about that. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're trying to celebrate, man. Well, I'm. am I saying anything about not celebrating? I don't think that came out of my mouth once. You guys can celebrate as much as you want. Go have a beer. Go do what you got to do. I... No one's being mean here, so I think it's funny that you would even say that. I've told you to go locate another spot, go have a beer, and everything's cool. You guys got to move from this parking lot, though. Uh, yeah, we don't want to be uh, taking away their business, as you can see. Yeah, I mean, it's packed today, so if we open up more spots, yeah. then I think it'll be better for everyone. Yeah. <laughs> So we got a uh, deal. We'll, uh, we'll get out of your uh, non-existent hair. I would say these are fine specks of hair, if you do ask me. I mean, we are entitled to our opinion. We are. We are. All right, gentlemen, you guys have a good day then. Please uh, get off the road quickly since I don't see license plates on those bikes. We'll get off quicker than you've ever seen. All right, that works. You have a good day. 
for it. What is it like for me? You too, oh. tight shirt. Thank you. Glad you were inspecting my body. <laughs> Fucking idiots, dude. What the hell? All right, well, that works. Just keep it simple. Don't need to run IDs or anything like that. Obviously, they shouldn't be on the road with dirt bikes like that, but I assume they're going to be taken off and uh, trying to find an exterior spot, so I might just sit here to see if we can see them go down to that road. Let me see if I can... Oh, God, what the fuck was that, bro? What are you doing? This motherfucker, are you fucking serious? Yeah, I just... I don't know if this is a cop or not, but I'm gonna pull his ass over. He just smashed the shit out of me. He didn't have any fucking lights on going about a hundred fucking miles per hour. Dude, that scared the absolute shit out of me. I don't know what this guy's doing, but he is fucking off. Fuck if you have lights on or not, bro. You're going a hundred fucking plus. 100 plus with no sirens. Didn't hear a goddamn thing. Are you fucking serious? This is the first time I've ever had to pull someone over. Get the fuck out of the car. Put your hands on the hood. Put your fucking hands on the hood right now. Put your fucking hands on the hood. Put your fucking hands on the hood. Hands on the hood. Hands on the hood. Don't fucking move. Don't fucking move. Get out of the hood. If you don't get out of the fucking car, dude. Hands on the fucking hood. Who's in the car? Uh, my partner. 1K24 dispatch. He has a medical emergency. 366 Sonora Freeway. I'm with a I, I got these lights off vehicle a, with off lights a, off a traveling over 100. I got him stopped here. Uh, one at gunpoint. Can I get another officer? And uh, I, I, I figured I'd try him on my car, man. No. You, who, do you have any weapons inside the car? No, I only got a taser, sir. Okay, no one no one move until I get someone else here, okay? Yes, sir. Guy in the passenger seat, do you have any weapons? I got a taser too. Alright, keep your hands on the dash. I'm out at 131 on the traffic stop. Four mic four is in route to one king two four. I didn't know what I had there. I was shaking, dude. Holy fuck. Everyone stay very calm and do not move, okay? Yes, sir. I have no idea what's going on here. I'm going to figure it out. If someone needs medical attention, I will get them help, but no one move. He said he has, he, he's got yeah, irritable bowel syndrome. That's, that's totally fine. So, We're going to figure it out in a second. Until then, I want no one to move. Save your story, okay? Yes, sir. Dude, I, damn. Holy shit. Intense as fuck. I mean, they didn't mean to hit me, which is why 22 the damage, but they were still traveling over 100 miles per hour with only lights. Alright, we gotta get passenger out of the car. I'm gonna go ahead and cuff this guy really quick. Don't move. I'm gonna put cuffs on you. Put your hands behind your back. Hey, passenger, keep your hands on the dash until the, my partner over there tells you to move, okay? Okay. Holy shit, man. Uh, I have no idea what this was, but I'm not not happy. I'm sorry, sir. I, I know I probably shouldn't have used them lights, man, but... Well, I'm sitting there I driving down the road, the and all of a sudden you pass me at 100 miles per hour and almost blow my door off. What's going on? I well, have I'm no sorry, idea. Man, I almost sir. died back there. These bozos. Fucking being bozos. Check the car and see if it's... It had red and blue lights when it passed me. Going 100 down 68. Hey, passenger. Yeah. Step out of the car. Put your hands on the roof. Your dirt bike go ahead and south. They're on the right shoulder. I'm going to do black shirt and tan shorts. I don't know if he's responding, but... We'll make sure that 
Oh, he knows it's for him. Dude, insane. What the fuck, man? That was intense, I gotta admit. Because I didn't know if I should have chased after it or not. I was like mid throw and I was like, shit, we're pulling over a cop. <laughs> but nope. Glad I stuck with it. I was gonna I was gonna have the conversation either way. Alright, which who who's uh what's the guy's name that I have? I'm J I'm Jamie Johnson, man. Jamie Johnson, okay. Alright. Okay, the, the, the weather was really awesome, but now I just want to fucking have it be dry. Okay, I got your stuff off you. I need now... Actually, I'm going to put you in my car, then we're going to have a chat, okay? Let me get these windows down. I got to be in the car to do that. Okay, 24 dispatch. We got 2 10 15 here. Oh! These things be fucking people up tonight. Alright, I'm gonna get off to the side a little more so that way I'm not sticking in the uh, street there. Okay, let's see. Hey, can you guys grab his story on what is going on here? I think if I was used to be using the Bradley Center, you okay? Okay, explain to me what's going on. Uh, did you guys hear me? Can one of you grab that guy's story so I can start seeing what the hell's going on yeah. here? Appreciate it. All right, explain to me what's going on, man. Yeah, I mean, so my buddy there, we were at my chum at my house, and I, I put these cool lights in there and stuff, just for, a, 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 I don't know. Hey, sir, you want to come over here where we can I have a conversation? I wasn't going to use him on the roadway, but he's, he, he said he started having okay. to take a poop real bad, but he couldn't poop, and he said something about, he, he felt like his, it was eating the inside, of, uh, eating it out the inside of him and stuff, so he was like, I, I gotta go to the hospital, man. And so I was like, shit, man, I, I get there, there fast, man. Okay, so that's why you were traveling 100 miles per hour down the road with lights on. Yes, sir. Yeah, I thought I thought he had like some uh, something wrong with his colon. Like, uh, I've seen people die from not being able to poop. Before. Okay, so are you a doctor? I, 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 no, sir. I did not want him to die. Oh, okay, so you're just assuming the role of a doctor. I'm not assuming the role of the doctor. I was, I was, I was. Assuming you were, you were being a uh, police officer. A medical guy. I wasn't trying to be a police officer. All in one. Sir. I was just trying to get him there safe and fast. Well, you know you almost hit my car, right? I, I do know I was close, sir. I, I do apologize yeah. for that. That was probably the calmest I've ever been driving, and then all of a sudden you come by at 110 miles per hour, almost blow both of my doors off on the driver's side. I'm sorry, I mean, I had good intentions. Yeah, well, the intentions almost cost many people their life. All right, um, you're gonna sit tight. What does the uh, role of your buddy have besides saying he has pain in his stomach? I, uh, he, I don't know. He, we were like doing like paying cop stuff and uh, on private property, of course. But before before this happened, stuff we're like doing doing the recording from like two view and stuff like boom, boom, bang, bang. <laughs> what does that even mean? That stuff, like, Oh. Like, bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? Anything that's relevant to my investigation? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, sorry. fantastic. I, I want my whole life story. Nope. All right, I appreciate it. You're gonna sit tight here. You're most likely gonna be coming with us, okay? Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Uh, do we have... He's got, uh, red and blues all throughout the car. Okay, any other stuff like weapons or vests? Anything that says police? I'll look, I'll look more specific for stuff like that. Yeah, I just, I was looking at the lights for now. Okay, let me get, I'm gonna get his story and I'm gonna be able to figure out. I know what the driver's going for, but we'll probably maybe cut this guy loose. You wanna? Uh, he did have a taser on him. His, his thing was, he said he had to, I guess he had to use the bathroom of, like, really bad. And he said he didn't even realize the lights were on. And he said the, I guess his buddy Jamie, was it, he said his name was, uh, bought some lights and put them in that car so okay and he he didn't think that traveling at 110 miles per hour 
even whether there's lights or not is probably not the best idea. I, I know you can hear me. I, I think it's a horrible. I think it's a horrible idea. Okay. But, but I. I, you know, I did I you say you, you felt like you had to go to the hospital? Can you he he said that we had to go to the hospital because like I couldn't I couldn't go. Did, did you make an attempt to try to like say you didn't feel that bad or did you feel enough? Did you feel so what I think we're gonna do is we're gonna have to hit the guy that's the driver of this vehicle with some type of impersonation charge since he was using red and blue lights on the on the road. Um, I'm going to see if I can find that penal code. Okay, here we go. Impersonation of a government employee, which is 75 seconds, which is a class B. So... That's pretty much what we're going to be going with. I don't have anything for the second guy. He's most likely just going to be let go. Um, since he had absolutely nothing to really do with the guy's decisions besides saying that he was injured. Unfortunately, there's nothing that we can do with that in and of itself. So we're going to get an arrest report going. Uh, it's going to be Jamie Johnson, I think. What's your name on the ground? Jeremy. Jeremy, okay. So uh, let's go ahead and unhook him. I'm going to probably let him go since he had nothing to do with it besides... Did you just hear that over the radio? Yeah, did you hear the radio? That, that was, yeah, that was a... Like, they just bowed it out for him, literally. Impersonators? So they just bowed it out for a white male, gray t-shirt, says yeah. enforcer, with a drop light taser holster. Yeah, but the, what I think we're at, though, is just because... I mean, I don't know if we have a crime that he committed pri previously that we don't know. I'm talking about necessarily for I just this one. Yeah, okay, for this one. Okay. So, yeah, so basically, even with the impersonation, what I'm thinking, though, is that he's he's just a... Pa I don't know. He also, he's decked out with that taser and shit. Um, okay. I don't know. For right this side, we'll keep him hooked up for now. Let me let me get this other guy's arrest report just taken care of really quick, and then we'll have one half of the equation done. Uh, Bernie, you want to try to find out about the, the more information on the bowler? So it's Jamie Johnson. We need more information on what's going on to know if, uh, obviously we know it's our subject. That is, uh, the Oracle. I don't know what other thing it is. Hey, do you know your plate? Uh, yes. Eight, nine, J-Y-T-051. Okay, thank I you. I only I knew, I only knew that because I, uh, I just got it uh, registered the other day. Okay, perfect. So, is there any reason why we would have uh, other people calling you guys in for impersonating the police? What else are you guys doing besides going 100 miles per hour down the road? No, no sir. I, I, I have no clue, sir. Okay. We're not going to get any other reports of you guys pulling anyone over or anything. Yo, okay. Will it help me out if I tell you the truth? Probably. Will it help me out? Alright, my buddy over there was uh, conned some lady that couldn't talk out of $50 out of $100 uh, pretending to be a cop on traffic stop. Don't tell him I told you that though. Okay, wait, say that again? And then, and then he, uh, he stopped somebody, and uh, he, uh, he, well, he went up and asked for her ID and stuff. And okay, what car did he use to do this? This one right here. So is it your car? Yes, sir. So did you swap seats and you were in the passenger seat? Uh, yeah, yes, sir. Okay, and is he gonna correlate that story? Is he just gonna say that you did it? And then, well, he's probably gonna say I did. He's a piece of shit. He stole her track, though. He, he stole her what? And, and stuff, and uh, he stole her track. He, he put her in cops. Oh, truck. Okay. The, it was a, yeah, it was a red. Like, where is the truck? Do you know where the truck is? Uh, I don't know. I think somewhere up near Grape Seed. Could you take us to it if you know, if you were near it? I, I, I don't know. Yeah, I think it was at the gas station off of Toledo. Um, Did you guys leave it there? Or? 
I think he lost it though, because he had me pick him up. Okay. Alright, sit tight for me. Yeah, no problem. Uh oh. Okay, so. You want to explain what's going on? Have you guys pulled anyone over today in this vehicle? Um, Honesty is your best policy right now. I don't know if I call it pulling over. We, we had a conversation with someone because they owed us some money. Who was the was the person a male or female? Uh, it was a woman. It was a woman. Okay, so did any other stuff happen with that female? Uh, I, I don't think so. You don't think so? Not that I know of. Okay, because we're like I said, I'm not just asking you these questions because I want to just play 21 questions with you, dude. I'm, I'm asking you because there's obviously something I know that you're not telling me. So was there something else that happened on that in that incident where you talked with the female and and got whatever you needed from her? How did you how did you come in contact with her? Uh, we just pulled up beside her and then I went to the window and I said, "Hey, I think you owe my buddy some money." And I think I think it was like a mute or something. I, I forget what they call. But, okay. Uh, Who was driving the vehicle? How, uh, my buddy was. Okay, so your buddy was driving the car. I didn't even click anything. And nothing else happened. You guys didn't do anything else. You just pulled up beside her. I mean, she gave us money, but I mean, other than that, that was it. Okay, and, uh... Alright. We're gonna keep him in handcuffs right now, and then... Let's, let's put him in the back of the car. That way we can have a quick chat and not have to worry about him running. Yeah, he just ran in same gear just crashed. Oh, no, he's back. Oh, oh that was quick. <laughs> Alright, stand up, dude. We're gonna put you in the back uh, of the car. There's, there's an investigator coming down uh, here in relation to... He's he's possibly related to a, sick, uh, one of a stolen vehicle, so... Uh, yeah, we're gonna have a chat about that here in a second. As soon as I can get him in a car. I'll get him. You want to just slap him in yours? Yeah, well, it's far enough away so they can't hear us. So, basically, the guy in my car says that the gentleman that's the passenger was driving the vehicle, pulled over the female vehicle, told her to get out of the car, put her in handcuffs, uh, got the money, stole her vehicle, took it to the gas station where the gentleman that is driving and owns the Oracle picked him up. And uh, they proceeded to drive down here where they, I guess, went into the Blaine County area and then passed by me. And this is where they're now stopped. I asked the other guy what his story was. I didn't get nearly as much information from what that guy says. He even said that the owner of the vehicle was driving the vehicle. Um, but we need to get a little more information, I think, before we can presume that he was the one that did it. If they have, they have a pair of handcuffs on him, then it would be easy because they said, the driver said that he put handcuffs on her. Do we have uh, any, I don't, there is a investigator that's supposed to be coming down here that has like an own an ongoing case with it or something. So, I don't know how far away he is, but he's supposed to be down here a few minutes ago. I can okay. over the radio and see if he's uh, coming down here. So. Yep, I'd say we could do that. I'm going to probably... There's no point in having these guys stick around if we have them in custody, or at least mine if we want to keep... I'm going to take mine in, we'll yeah, keep the other one here. Um, yeah. And if he needs me to, I can come back and explain what I've found from both of them. Just tell him that he's going to be at jail. Will do. Cool, thank you. Alright, later dude. Romeo 31, secondary, calling out 20. We're going to be, he's on 68, 243. They're still good. Vehicle. Eastbound 68. Alright, four my four to this. Rock with a four wheeler in the back. I'm passed on your left. Okay, so we are active in a pursuit now. 68. 260. 260, dude. I just crashed out too. Final stop. 260 route 68. Route 68, 260. We got a little bit ways to go, but we get we're gonna get there. Let me uh, 22 any damage because it probably looked like a train hit me. Alright, 260, we're not too far away. 
Go ahead and whip this charger a little. Romeo 30, where's she at? They lost her. No. Come on, guys. I expect better. We're not too far. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Got her tased. Good shit. They got her tased. Copy, taser deployment. We slammed on the brakes. 330, she's in 60. And 60. Is it a female or a male? It looks like a male. Okay. I don't know. Let me get, uh... Control. Alright, they got, they got commands. It might be times two. I don't know what's going on. It looks like a, uh, female. I'm sorry, it looks like a male, not a female. Someone got commands. I hurt my knees. Three room gnostics one. Go ahead and turn tonight. Refrain from self attack. Someone giving commands? One. Yeah, they're giving commands. Okay, I can't hear anything. Uh, I think I'm just getting in there. I shot out. You, uh, okay? Fuck you, you bitch. I'm still on my knees. <laughs> you weren't on your knees, but okay. Get away from me. I don't know where the hell she is. She's in that thick I'll ass kick brush. Your ass. Oh. Come near me, I'll kick your ass. Uh oh. Come near me, I'll kick your ass. I'm gonna get ready for a taser just in case. Yeah. I'll kick your ass. Get away from me. Don't you fucking think about it. You're gonna get tasered. Hey. Get away from me. I don't I can't hear him. Okay, we got oh, we man. got control. Oh come on. Hey, good shit. Good shit. Copy okay. the Is there any on. other subjects or is that it? I'm gonna go you back to gun here. Oh, Was it just plus. one, Brandon? Just just one person? Yeah, yeah it was okay. just one. Clarify control station 3, AMR 3702. Let me get you out. 260 rousting stage for two times. Okay. Where is it at? 31 County. Down here by the other side of the street. Mall up by the bar. I forget the exact location, but it's up by the bar. Okay, vehicles here. Uh, look secure. That is the smallest car, so. Confirm 51. I'm gonna open the trunk. Yeah, she took off from that gas station real quick, Control too. Control 285. Yeah, uh, we're, we're good with the car. It's empty. Currently in route 2, SSPD right. will be available for calls right. in two mics. Well, God shit, that was good. I mean, we were... <laughs> Toss his gun and goes into <laughs> shower to make a house of bleach. Okay. Monkey 24, we're code 4 here with the subject 1015. We could lift. Copy, I'm going channel left 0423. Resume number RTO. That was a good, uh... I wasn't involved, but I think it was good for them. I got, um... Some uh, white powder in this bag and a bottle. So there might be a few more things to tack on. Oh, great. Okay, so at this point, I need to figure out what these substances are in the bag. <laughs> He's sitting on the back of his bed. Nice. I like it. All right. Okay, you're good to hook it. Appreciate it. Hi, Mike. Yep. Go. All right. So we have a confirm on cocaine. Control to Lincoln 2, left 4. Okay, I don't know if she got back to me about the beer bottle being open or not. I'm going to go ahead and give this to them so they can just take it. And then they can kind of go from there. I wish they didn't drink it, though. As the investigator showed up. Watch your head off her. <laughs> As the investigator showed up. Uh, no. Okay, because I got her beers here along with her cocaine. Yeah, and you're drinking what I can see too. Technically holding it. Oh, okay. I'm just taking a quick splash to make sure. I like him. All right, so who wants to hold on to this? Because I'm going to take off from here. If uh, this is a positive for cocaine, I got it in the bag. I got the test kit for evidence and then also the beer bottle. I don't know if it came back open or not. Um, so if someone wants to verify that, then at least you'll know if it came from that store. Uh, 
Well, I ain't got a chunk on my vehicle, so that's not going to be explored. So. Hold on, I'm gonna look at looks. I'm looking at the beer bottle to see if it's open. Is it open? I'm hoping that my subconscious will. T oh, look, it's open. So if it is from the store, you'd have to probably check back with the store. She probably swigged it on the way here, so. Okay, sounds good. I'm gonna. Who 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 wants to take this then? I'll take it. I'll okay, there you go. So you can drink it. I appreciate it. You want me to sign that away? No. Yeah, if you could sign the uh, form, you're, you're gonna get shackled in the, in the car middle most, of the so seat where you rather have you as a reference than someone else. Um, Okay. No, this is there. not my vehicle, I, I apologize, I can't. It's pretty much just saying that I didn't steal it when I transported it to where you wanted me to. Uh, speaking of which, where do you want the vehicle? Uh, let's go ahead and bring it to, you guys want it down at the, uh... Can I have my car back? At the Sandy? Yeah, I can go down to the Sandy station. Yep, SSPD will do. Okay, awesome. Cool, I right, appreciate awesome. it. Thank you guys. Alrighty. Right, Jordan, we're gonna head down to the station since she's heading her hand, her head and shit. I'll cut you around. Okay. Have a good one. I'm a nutcase and I'm on. Yeah, you are a nutcase. It's exactly <laughs> what, what you are. Stolen <laughs> from her. Whoa. Jesus. Oh, not on, not on my screen. We're just gonna say that didn't happen. <laughs> Shit, bro. Okay, so vehicle traveling super fast down the road here. Um, I didn't get a speed. My radar is acting a little weird. I see them right there. They just pulled into the 24-7 uh, parking lot here. Damn. Hey, yo. Come here, man. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hey. Come here. Come here. What you, hey, come here. Come outside. We're gonna have a quick chat because you're not just gonna walk away from that shit. All your doors just fell off, too. <laughs> oh, uh, they're meant to be off. I've, oh. I've got my tuna. Okay, let's go ahead and so walk outside. Put your, tuna, put your tuna Put your tuna okay. on the shelf. Oh. You didn't pay for it yet, okay. so put your tuna on the shelf. And then walk out here. We're gonna go to the front of my car, okay? Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. I've modified front of my, my car. car. So Perfect. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. All right. Face, face me and just sit on the bumper. There you go. Okay. I think I... Yeah, I was going to say, I think there was a bolo on this guy that just came out. Good. You're going to sit tight. Get your ID while you're sitting there, okay? I stopped you for your... Uh, a high rate of speed coming down the street here. I think you also might be wanted by... Uh, some other officers for questioning. I'm not exactly sure what's going on. Yes. Oh, God damn it. Why? That is correct, sir. What have I done? Uh, you're speeding all over the place, man. Same thing that I got. I'm just I've got you clocked at 80 once and 95 the second time. Yo, who wants it? I D. Go ahead and hand it to me. Uh, 23, yellow check for investigation. Cool. Copy that. Fantastic. Yeah. Okay. Mr. Alex Matson. That's the one. Okay. All right. Sit, sit tight out here with him. I'm gonna run your stuff. This is gonna be code four. Okay. We're gonna have a mail at the station about a ten minute drive. Copy. Okay. We're gonna submit that. We're done with that. Um, so let's what, go ahead and run the name. The way you are, Mr. Matson. Oh, I put them both in the I'm same thing. Fine. That's okay, not you right. Are aware that this vehicle that you've been operating is unroadworthy, right? Oof. It's got it's got a little little teeny weeny bit on the back. It's it's teeny weeny. Is that weeny a trophy weeny, truck? Yeah, yeah, I guess it is. It's just missing all of its stuff, so it looks a little odd. That has to be it, though. Baby pink. I do see some pink on it. He has uh, no revoke, no weeny, suspended, weeny. no active warrants. You don't even have to search it up now because it's all yeah, connected. There it is. Oh, God. All right, so let's see. We got three addresses filed as well, too. Last report was from the 26th. was a day ago. Uh, so we're going to do a quick search. We're going to see exactly if this is the right car. I'm out with your car at 068. I'm going to see if there's a license plate. You know the license plate to your vehicle? Uh, 
No. I, I need to go. Have a look. One Whoa. Second. Let's relax. Don't get in that car. Let's just okay. relax. Hop out of the vehicle. Come back over here. Throw in your door on the ground. I can figure it out. I just was I, just, I was quickly asking if you knew it or not. Oh, no. I don't know it. Okay. Well. I found it out. Oh, God. Fantastic. Thank you. <laughs> so it's the, yep, it's it's the one that I was already suspecting, so I appreciate that. All right, so oh, what did uh, what are the speeds that you got him for earlier? Five, tango, five, three, two, I've got him at 86 at, uh, on uh, Sonora, six, and then again at 98 on Sonora. Okay. And he's oh. driving he's driving recklessly uh, all over the place. Okay, if you want to go ahead and get him his citations, I. Just was sitting there and saw that he passed by my radar to click up or anything, so you'd be the best off in court. Uh, we're gonna be if you want to take his ID here, it's Alex Matson. Uh, yep. Appreciate it. Yep. I'll sit tight with him. Alrighty, thank you. You should get one of these trucks the helico. Uh, you want me to get one of those trucks because they're hella cool? Yeah. Okay. Um, yo, you get in it. Have a go. Have a go. You're it's so cool. County bowls. Well, I appreciate the offer, but I think I'm going to have to pass. Oh. It, it. It's, it's your last, bro. It's your last. It is my last. What if you lost your truck? Neon lights and blue headlights. No oh, suspicion. no. No, I'm just, I'm just saying, what if you yeah, lost it? Wouldn't that be a bummer? Yeah, don't Copy go last Okay, well then we should probably be thinking about Let's better choices when we're driving our truck, correct? Yes, I'm sorry. Well, if I offer oh. you drive my truck, can I drive yours? Uh, no, we're going to stay right That's here. Nice. We're going to stay right here. Stay in front of my uh, vehicle for me. Oh, I, I Do you have you had any alcohol, that. drugs, or anything like that today? No. Okay. Well, then That's stay in front of my vehicle and start listening to what I'm saying because at this point I'm getting a little confused on why you aren't paying attention to what I'm saying. You know? Oh, I'm sorry. All right. Well, I appreciate the uh, apology. I just need a little more cooperating. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool, I think we got, I think we're working on stuff here. Romeo 31, I just witnessed a white coquette heading eastbound East Joshua Road, Route 13, recklessly driving, oh, doing so, yeah, I, burnout I in the go. roadway. You so, are going to sit tight, he's going to chat with you here in one second. Okay, yeah, I'll just uh, write up a couple citations then. Okay, we want to tow his car then? Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get a, uh, a 51 out here. Okay, they just uh, started a Signal 100, so I will try to fish one through the chat. I need a static. Alrighty, sounds good. Oh. Cool. Shots fired on the Sandy Shore Station, we get a Ranger down. Say, what? Oh no. It never ends, dude. Um, let's see, RT, can we... I'm sure you can access money at SSPD. 242 Route 68. Okay, sir, so it's your lucky day. You're not coming to jail with us, but if you do continue to do this stuff, you're going to have an issue where you're going to have to come with us. I'm going to tell you right now, your vehicle is going to be in tow, or your vehicle is going to be towed for the fact that it is not roadworthy. You don't have plates on the vehicle. You're missing several. I think you have restraints so you can have no doors. I'm not exactly sure. I haven't brushed up on that side of the penal code. I've got one little, little teeny weeny plate on the back. One little teeny weeny plate on the back. You want to show me that plate? Yeah, yeah, just, just follow me. It's really teeny weeny. It's really, really teeny weeny. Okay, I'm looking. I don't see anything. Yeah, it's, re it's teeny weeny. <laughs> yeah, that's that's you handwriting something to the bar, my guy. That is not an official plate from the EMV. I appreciate the thought, but that's not how it works. Oh, damn it! What if I get a plate? Can I drive it? 
if, if you want to get it out of impound, that's fine. Let's take a let's take a step back over to my car here so we don't get hit by traffic. You got to get it registered. If you get a plate for it and you get an actual plate, you stick it on. You don't have to worry, you know? But also, you can't be driving 100 plus down the road driving all reckless. That's that's the real reason why we're here. Your vehicle is getting towed because of the state it's in. Damn it. Fuck. Alright, Mr. Matson. So you're gonna gonna be receiving um Oh yeah. Five five separate citations today, okay? Oh my walk style's been gone for god knows how long, dude. It just disappears on me. Maintaining lanes. Another for your right of way violations. I have you at uh eighty six miles an hour and ninety six. I've actually felt really good this whole episode. Like there's been zero issues at all with Coughing, like a few cops here and there, but other than that, your, uh, I think we're, we're like 95% right. there, dude. Let's go. About $2, okay. Fuck me. I can't pay that. Well, unfortunately, uh, well, you don't have to pay it right now. You dorm. pay it in court when they send you the ticket, which is weeks from now, so. Yep, so uh, if, uh, if, you, if you have any questions about anything about the citation, there's a court date and a phone number on the back of the uh, citations, okay? I highly suggest you pay it, because okay. if you won't, you'll have a bench warrant out, and it's not worth it for violations like this. I can, I can run really fast. Okay. Uh, I, can, I can run away from you really, like really fast. I, I got, like, high school champion for, like, running. I'm not in radio reception. Oh, good. I tried to call for RT on a uh, tow truck, and it says I'm not in radio reception. I don't know what that means. Yeah, um, out of character, you have to do uh, T slash radio reconnect. Well, okay, let me try it. Copy, we're coming. Yeah. All right, sir, so I can just get your signature at the uh, bottom here of this citation, all right? It's not our mission to guilt. It's just saying you'll take care of it accordingly, whether that's uh, paying the fines online or uh, calling the court or going to court for them. Okay. Oh, there you go. There you go. I don't know how to do okay, that, but okay. Sir, uh, this, these, I'm going to have to ask him later. Be yours. Here's your information back as well. Are you feeling all right today, sir? He's fine. Yeah, I'll get it. Don't worry about me. It's okay. Okay, because uh, I've, I've seen you're pretty shaky, and then your signature here is kind of all over the place. Are you talking about the unit that called us white multi? Yeah, no, I'm all good. I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Um, can I, can I go? I mean, I'm, oh, he's gonna try to go and do run a test. I just thought he had, you know, that's the way he talked or spoke or something, you know what I mean? Um, your vehicle is not roadworthy, so today it's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be towed, okay? To, uh, to the SSPD, so of course you're gonna have to either walk o walk from here or find a different ride, okay, whether that's Uber or a taxi, something like that. Copy. Uh, am I clear to uh, yeah, here? Okay. I got you. I got you. Go ahead and move. Copy. All entry advised 0452, you will channel left through the region of Rio traffic. We just okay, swap. Well, I don't have anything further for me or for you. Yeah, I don't right. know about good the, too. Uh, the fine deputy here. Well, they get the 22 tango that white mobile. Nope, I'm good. Can I go? You are free to walk, sir. Thank you. I'll, I'll see you guys later. Okay, bye. Oh, God, don't get killed. Control one king 24. Ah, oh, damn it, I said don't get killed. Fuck. Go ahead. Oh, are you at the SSPD requesting a best way. order or a shot fired officer? M4, you guys are clear. Oh, Come on, man, what are you doing? Hold on, sir. Don't move. You all right, sir? You got an ambulance out here for you? Go ahead. I don't understand, people. You literally can just get let go. Oh, we we are all gonna die right now. Oh my god! Oh my god! I called it. I called it. I called it. Holy shit! You did. You called it. Oh my fuck. See, all you had to do was just walk away, man. You just had to fucking walk away. I'm walking so the street. sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I knew it, dude. I'm gonna walk away. Oh, now you want to walk away. Now you want to walk away. Yeah, it wasn't good enough before. I'd say you just cut him loose. Just let him get out of here. Yep, 
go well, on just, with your day. I'm yeah. the shoulder, sir. Yeah, please. Matter, yeah, don't do anything I'll stupid. I don't got enough left in me to handle yeah, it. Yeah, go ahead. I'm Have a good day, I sir. Stay out of the road. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god. Alright. I'm gonna need a lot of Icy Hut. Don't, don't God, watch out. God damn it, I don't wanna die. <laughs> Jesus Christ. If what the fuck? Okay. Sorry, well, I can go ahead and try and get a tow on out yeah. here if you want to. Yeah, how do you, you, how do, you do the thing that you were saying? Go ahead. Yeah, it's a uh, slash radio. What do I open, though? We were one of the uh, original units on Wait, do it? Oh. In the chat. Yeah, I, I get what you're saying. Okay. Yep, and yes. now we're good. Okay, yeah, if you want to call it out, that's perfect. Oh, okay. I'm going to head back to the okay. station there. Go ahead. Alrighty. Okay, you have a good one. Yeah, I'm gonna be. Um, yep, you too. Appreciate it. Uh, Thank you. From the Sandy Shores PD. If you can All right, cool the bomb, stuff. That was a great, yeah, great, great patrol. For, uh, really enjoyed it. Any tens of the there? They usually aren't that uh, blue. Like the whole time, I just that was an hour and twenty minutes, but that was like a very, very active hour and twenty minutes. Usually, it's like an hour, fifteen, thirty minutes. It could take to get an episode, but there could be a lot of downtime in between calls. But wow, that was a nice, that was a very yeah, nice control. My seatbelt's not on. Um, those are the ones I like. I don't know if it's just EUP that makes it so much more tasteful to look at. Like you could just sit there and kind of just soak it all up and you have this beautiful outfit to look at. You also have different people's faces that you look at in those outfits. So it's not just like, hey, here's Earl. Oh, and here's Earl and Earl and Earl and everyone's fucking named Earl. So I think it's it's so much better, so much better. And it's gonna be so hard to go through all the departments now with er when everyone has so much good stuff. Like it's gonna be really, it's gonna suck. Um, but nonetheless, that is gonna be where we wrap it up. They got something at the station, but we've been in for an hour and 20 minutes of like raw time. All right, that is gonna be where we wrap it up, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for coming on and watching this episode of DOJRP and we will see you next video.